right here at dollar pills we are fighting we shut three cops down over here basically and we are having a pinch point on the mega mall so we are kind of like doomed anyway but i think we could have gotten more with us you know it's like you're in the middle of everywhere and everywhere can target you like mostly is a good place to like shoot and dip per se you know shoot but i didn't know like the first one came up the ladder so quick man it was kind of crazy yeah they had class twos yeah they have class two so i'm i'm like the boys getting getting fucking uh 12 guys there that is like holy fuck the cops told us basically in character that you know we shot down 12 of them i'm like wow because i could count like 12 or 13 just in the near me that was up you know it was like running around and then i looked around there was a helicopter in the air as well and there was somebody on the mega mall as well plus there was other cars coming to the scene so the kick is really bad yeah yeah i don't know do the cops have like the kick on the class twos as well like uh, we have on the ak's no the boys put in work though yeah they put in work man really bad but still you have an automatic weapon and they do like more damage than the brownings you know but we know what we're getting into basically like i'm not like sitting here and complaining or anything you know because the cops have told us they will use whatever measure you know to stop what we're doing and i kind of like understand so it's fun with the roleplay, you know, because the roleplay kind of like allows the escalation and the stuff that's happening and it's good. Like if they parked and mag dump your car, it's disabled right away. What? Sorry guys, I'm checking something. Oh shit. It's time for me to stop uh stop with the snooze. Have you guys seen the new like Twitch uh Have you guys seen the yeah, have you guys seen the new Twitch shit? Like somebody linked this to me basically. Let me show you guys. Additionally, we're not allowed the following products and service. Weapons such as firearms, explosive related product, understandable. Adult oriented product or services such as pornography, sexual content or male product, health service allowed. Tobacco and tobacco related products such as e-cigarettes, 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 vape pens and chewing tobacco. I don't have chewing tobacco though. It's not chewing tobacco, but it's kind of like it's time to we're done it's over for us we are finished we're quitting today chat we quit today then we use something else that is healthy and has no nicotine okay they look like this they're white we use that instead That's what I use, yeah. 
Yeah. Like nicotine free products. We use that, okay? We stop with other shit, okay? We're, it's over. I'm stopped buying that. We're not gonna, or I cannot use it when I'm streaming, basically. It's not about just nicotine. Yeah, 07, 07. We're fucked. We're quitting right now. Medical f products such as medical trades, okay? Medical cures of drug. Okay, I understand that. Political content, including paid promotion of politicians, political parties, or issues of pol public debates. What? Isn't that basically what Hassan is doing? Or. Uh, cannabis related product including vaping and delivery okay okay uh yeah this is actually well you know it's it's their it's it's their platform but i think they will like the more restrictions you put on people you know the more up, uprising you will get the people towards what you're doing as well okay uh we're gonna be on the edge <laughs> we're gonna be on the edge some of this makes sense yes yeah, some of it makes sense some of it doesn't make like i can understand not promoting i cannot see that either like when it comes to politics like it's a platform like it's that's what make it good you know like be creative politics non-politics vice versa whatever you know like when it comes to like auto of course like some of the adult stuff weapons of course and stuff like that i don't understand like i, I don't think it should be like mentioned at all promoting medical stuff and stuff like that i think that is good as well just show him some love what who What? Vero just permad? Why are you giving me this? She permad Vero? Holy shit! Okay. That's a big character as well. That's uh... She's starting with something new. Lost any Vagos from your era, I think. Yeah. I think Vero is... Um... Actually, we'll be happy. <laughs> well, we don't know this in character yet, though. Yeah, some of this makes sense, basically. Is there anything on... Sorry, I'm, I'm just more intrigued about this why this terms of services from twitch and stuff
I mean, I'm trying to... Where's this information getting from? Actually made me happy, yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised it's not on Twitter yet either, like... Is there anything on Reddit about it though? I don't know. She's streaming right now. Not the queen of the body, oh, bro. I actually cry. I love her for her character. The character is kind of like a love hate character, you know? But, uh. Go over there and show some love and support, man. Like, it's hard one to fucking perma your character. That is actually a hard one. From what I'm seeing, it might only apply to branded and sponsored content. Uh, the Twitch stuff. <laughs> Is a vero incoming? Nah. Well, we don't know about it in character yet, so nothing much we can do. Nothing much we can do. What is Dom doing over there? Comes out from a back alley. Let's change to the scenery here. Let's see what's happening. What you up to, Dom? Everyone by you and me has gone to bed. What? I said not much. I think everyone else has gone to bed. Oh, everybody's sleeping? Yeah, I just saw you come out of that alley. Wonder what... Oh, uh, yeah, I was, um, taking a call on the roof. Oh, alright, 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 alright. <laughs> no, I'm around. I'm just chilling, grilling. Back soon why? Uh, I put an order in with Zuck earlier. With who? Zuck from GG. Oh, he's around? Uh, he was this morning. Hoping to get back to me sometime this afternoon. Yeah, I was hoping to get a hold of him as well, but for other reasons. Uh, yeah, him and Jules were about this morning. Um, so was Marty actually. Yeah, I saw Marty. He was over here. Yeah, he was playing with the um, his babies for a bit. Mm. 
Shanks fighting this, never had a stylist. Better wear white, I ain't talking no cyclist. Bought it on Brutal, you ain't built like this. Living two lives, no mighty Cyrus. When I switch off, sound ill bronchitis. Man, I blow smoke, car, man, I own violence. Shoot one shot and you're gonna turn silent. Word on the street, did the ops come flying? Wu Chang's finest, never had a stylist. Better wear white, I ain't talking no cyclist. Bought it on Brutal, you ain't built like this. Living two lives, no mighty Cyrus. When I switch yeah, I'm just chilling, gonna be honest with you. Working over here if people come in with the cars and then you know have my tow truck in front there as well as so I can do towing at the same time. Well makes sense. Um Dre was saying about uh trying to get Shana to set up like a haze towing. Yeah, I told him to do that, you know, and get some fucking haze logos on the tow trucks. Yeah. That would be insane. That's a good idea. Yeah, and then like you don't need to pay them extra, but they can be around here, be mechanic, and they can have the tow truck at the same time. Advertise for haze, yeah. and yeah. Yeah, and if they've got the if their car needs re if it's being towed because it needs repairing, they just bring it straight here and do both. Yeah, that's uh, was my idea as well. They can like put in like a certain price what we take for that you know and we can charge them through the business as well that way it's like kind of like better you know if you have a standard price let's say you it costs you two and a half thousand dollars you know to get your car towed yeah. tow it over here we give you a bill of that and off that money you get paid every week you know from ace you get legal money in return yeah there was a few um, solo um, tow drivers that were doing that, like working at mechanic shops and tow, like a year ago, but you don't really see it that much now. Yeah, I think I'm the only one who is uh, owing right now. Mm. Yeah, I'm the only one on the tow group. Yeah, there's no cars, you know, it's only cops, you know, requesting pounds. Mm. It's kind yeah. of fun as well, it's it's different though, but I need to make money. I lost like fucking 50 grand because of shooting cops. Oh please, you're still richer than half of the boys. Um, yeah, probably. Well, I used a lot of money, I bought like 30 guns, you know, and I needed to use my own money for it. Yeah, to be honest, I think I'm richer than half of the boys. So you don't know why i think it's because a lot of the boys don't like to do too much you know they like to hang around have a good time and just joke around and drive around and talk shit yeah i know but it's not like i do a lot i've got 10 jobs and i barely show up to half of them well i think the difference is like in between your jobs you actually make money mm. they don't give a fuck I'm not too proud or... Well, I'm not proud. Um, I can't think of the word, but yeah. I'm I'm quite happy to do dirty work as well. Yeah. If I've got friends that want to go do Sunny, then I'll join them. If there's nothing else to do, I'll go pan. Like You do what needs to be done, basically. That's what you're telling me. Yeah. And obviously people and everybody enjoys the things that are more exciting in life but sometimes we have to do things that aren't as fun you are not wrong If I never have to wash a corpse again, I'm happy. Yeah, I hope I stay away from that shit as well. Wondering what people will do though when they start, you know, losing their money because of all the cost and shit, you know? When you can't do oil rig anymore.
Yeah. I think the boys will be alright. They know how to make money. It's more about the will to do it. Honestly, they've got more motivation than the people I used to spend time with. Yeah. They only knew how to spend money they didn't have. Yeah, you're not wrong. Hey, what's your ping? Uh, what you mean? What's good? What's your ping? My ping? Mm hmm. Uh, what's going on? Just, just tell me your ping, KJ. Just tell me what the I, fuck you're gonna I, kill I, me? I just, no, I'm not gonna kill you, KJ. I would have done that a long time ago. I was gonna do that. Just give me your ping. <laughs> Uh, okay, sounds weird. Uh, three one one. All right, come on down. So what's going on? We're at the cemetery. Just come, KJ. All right, all right. I'll be there shortly. You good? Uh, yeah. Apparently, the new leader of the Vagos want me to go to the fucking cemetery up here. It's good, Frankie. No, KJ, uh, I'm with Vero right now. Nothing's going to happen. Don't worry about it. Just come and say goodbye to her. You're with Vero right now. Nothing going to yeah, happen. What the fuck nothing. do you mean? Well, I, I heard you at you and Juan's phone call. You said, and I heard yeah, he's, he's calling me and saying he need my ping. And of course, you know, like, yeah, like um, come, come on, man. Like, what the fuck? Come the cemetery across from Playa Vista. We're here right now. Vero's in the dark. All right, uh, all right. I'll be there shortly. <laughs> Come on, we need to play it out a little bit. All right, apparently I need to go to the cemetery. Frankie called me as well. Okay. Do you have a car here? Uh, yeah. Can I borrow it up to the cemetery? Uh, sure. Is it on your own? Um, I don't know. Sounded kind of sad. You want to come? I'll come. Why don't you just sit in the car? Porn acting shit, yeah. What is going on? What's happening? Uh, uh, this is for you and the rest of the boys on the note. You can go say your goodbye. Just do me a favor, take the chain and the mask off the flag. Out of respect, yeah, I can do that. Try calling the rest of them, but I don't think they're awake. Yeah, everybody went to sleep. So, what is who is this note from? Like, from you guys or? No, it's from her. From Vero. Mm hmm. Oh shit. Okay. Yeah, you can go say your goodbyes. She wanted me to pass it on to you and the rest of them. What happened? Can't tell you, KJ. Cannot tell me. All right, all right. Where are they? Over there? Yeah, she's right over there. Frankie, this way. Frankie's with her. Mm, he's walking down. <laughs> Read the note. Holy 
вообще. She took someone on her head, and the person who she took on her head fucked up, and she paid the consequences. You know how it goes down there. All right, all right. Let me read read the note then. KJ, JJ, Benji, and Chico. Boys, if you read this, my time has come. Promise were made and I have to fulfill them. Just want to thank you for, for welcoming me into the barrio in the beginning. You guys shaped me into the person I was today. Just know I stayed true until the very end. Love you boys. And have a wonderful life. Be there for each other. I will miss you all. Pero. Okay. This is the last place for the queen of the barrio. Yep. Our last resting place. Now she gets to go with all the Vagos in the sky. Is the last one from the old crew? Pretty you know? much. The last one left is Wang. What's that? Well, Everyone Wang, else is Wang new. hasn't Wang. been around. Wang's been around, yeah. Uh, no, I talked to him Angel. like yeah. a little bit ago. So I, I wouldn't say, you know, like, yeah, he was around one day, you know. Yeah. Vero will hold it down, basically. Mm-hmm. Vero is very heavy. I know, I know. I spoke to her, you know, like a couple of weeks ago. <sighs> well, she gets to go up and have a cerveza with fucking Chino now. Yeah. The rest of the boys. Mm-hmm. Oh man. <laughs> hey, give me a minute, Frankie. Of course, KJ. Appreciate you. No worries, bro. Love you, Vero. Just read your notes. Some heavy shit. Lost one with the true color, you know? The color yellow. You bled it. Always have done. Always will do. That is your memory and that is your legacy. went wrong what happened but you guys were good down there boys if you're reading this my time has come promises were made and I have to fulfill them just wanted to thank you for, for welcoming me into the barrier in the beginning 
You were born for the barrio. You were breathing the barrio. You were living the barrio. You were the barrio. You were the queen of the barrio. There were nowhere, you know? no Nobody over you. Nobody beside you. How can you end up like this? I just spoke to you, Vero, like... Two weeks ago, you were smiling, having a good time, living your life. And now this... You know, Vero, I've probably not said it to you, and I guess, you know, it's a time for everything, but... I miss the good old days. The memories, you know, of the barrio, you know, the barbecues, the cervezas, you know. You and Miguel waking up, coming out of your house, you know, chilling down there. Living the good life. Flourishing. Everything was yellow. Because it never became the same again. I will miss you, Vero, you know? And I know that if the rest of the boys have been awake right now, they will be here with me. You always have been, you always will be, you know? You always have a place in my heart, you know? And I think if I talk for the rest of the boys as well, they would say the same. Only thing I have about you is good memories, Vero. This is your last resting place for the Queen. The Barrio Queen. Bye. Hey, my condolence, all right? If there is anything you guys need, just tell me. Appreciate it. I appreciate the call. Yeah, of course. Why do I lie to myself like this? Man, this is a big, this is a very sad day. Just give me a minute. I appreciate you, Frankie. No worries, bro. Doesn't matter where we are, we all had a relationship with Vero, you know? Yeah. I know. It's so fucking sad, bro. Now I need to tell Junior, I need to tell Carlito, I need to tell fucking Baby Loco. Oh my god. Yeah. Them here, I need to talk to you, you know? Chico yeah. and JJ and Benji, Benji. about this. Yeah. Oh no, GG. Oh no. They knew each other so long, man. Fucking yeah. hell.
Yeah, I've known her as well for a long time. Oh. Well, gotta see if JJ is around. Well, I'm gonna go and drive about. Hey, and do your thing, there. man. Do your Hi, thing. Thank you guys for coming. Oh, hey. I can do one better. You guys around. Was Vero, you know Vero from the Vagos? Um, you mentioned her the other day. Yeah, um, she's dead. Oh no, sorry, man. Probably the last of the old school Vagos, you know, when I was down there. Yeah, it was the queen, you know, the barrio. We're gonna tell Speedy. No. Wow. Hello. Yo, what's good? Me just chilling. Hey, Dom. Which Vago song should we play in her honor? Vero's song? Yeah, we should. I guess you're gonna have to let a few of the boys know about that. Sana did it? How long ago did you do it? What is the name of the song? Or was it Char? I think maybe it was Char? Anyone, if anyone finds it, give me a link or whatever, because I'm looking through in YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that the YouTube link? Don't 
Damn. That is a good song, but that is... Uh, who made this song? This is Char, isn't it? Char who made this? Oh, she will be missed, yeah. Yeah, it's Char, yeah. Vero would be missed. Oh man, what is happening? People are moving on. Benji will probably be I don't know I don't know what relation Benji and Vero had but you know some type of like like Vero was a big part of like KJ JJ Benji and Chico's life you know when we were Vagos she was always keeping it down you know like friend somebody we always talk to he will probably hide his feelings as usual but uh like she's a, been a big part and a big character in uh or she's been a character that's been in the life of those three characters for a long time per se yeah he loved little like a sister yeah yeah i think so as well rebecca yeah i don't know how we will react to the news I think I'm like Benji loved Vero, yeah. AJ did the same, you know. Like AJ always when he talked to Vero was like, you know, if you ever need anything, we're here, you know. You know we're not a part of your family and you're you know, trust and truly bleeding yellow, but we're still here. Yeah. I don't know. Let's take a look at the note again. Apparently, boys, if you're reading this, my time has come. Promises were made and I have to fulfill them. So apparently, there is something she. Somebody fucked up, like. Like Frankie said, somebody fucked up and Vero needed to pay the price. Fulfill I just want to thank you for, for welcoming me into the bar in the beginning. You guys shaped me into the person I was today. Just know I stayed true until the very end. I love you boys and have a wonderful life. Be there for each other. I will miss you all. Better. I'm crying again you know you know that the character has like what I used to say before as well like the character has made an impact on you if you cry if you're angry if you're upset if you're happy it doesn't matter which emotions you're getting as long as you're getting some emotions those characters are doing something that you like in certain ways like you can you can like a character you know but the character make you angry and upset but you fuck kj you know what i mean but it gives you an emotion per se you know what i mean so then you know the yeah it was a queen she was a queen that it was the queen queen of the barrio <laughs> oh 
Oh man. This is gonna be some news to bring to the boys. Should probably put this note up in the tower and... Uh, go back. I think we do the... Um, full truck. Yeah, we shoot him a text, so let's see, like, if he's back on JJ, yeah, that is meta, so I cannot do anything. You like it? Like you're about to go towing. Yeah, yep, yeah. Mm -hmm. I have my tow truck over here, you know, doing some work. Then I can be <laughs> a mechanic at the same time. That is true. Hey, give me a second. Kill two birds on one side. Now I can wait for jobs, you know, drive out. And if somebody calls you guys, you know, and say, hey, I need a mechanic, my car is shot down. You'll be like, oh, I know a guy. You can call up KJ and he can come and pick you up your car. That's actually very smart thinking. Also, President, she's the little female empowered and loyalty. I had a lot of respect for her character. Yeah. Towered at the same time. Money. Yeah. It's a service we can offer, you know, at Haze as well. If you check the yellow page, I have my ad out, like, uh, mechanic. I think it's like Haze mechanic. Or do I have a mechanic? Yeah, Haze mechanic and tow. Oh, yeah. There it is. And everybody else from Seaside, you know, are sleeping, so I'm just chilling. Yeah, that old, uh, Lance, which is, uh, Keandre's alias at the moment, he's up in grapes, he napping in a boat <laughs> shed. Oh. the Lance, no. Yeah. Yeah, using, uh, Shaka's ID, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I think uh, OJ had a warrant that he needed to serve today. He got like a 100k fine. Oh, he was still in debt, wasn't he? Uh, no, he was already. No. He, he got out of debt. Uh, he got out of debt just to get back in it. Yeah. Yeah. Poe oh. um, got him out of debt and now he's back in debt. Hold on, did Poe just give him a loan? I'm not sure. Post sitting on like 2.2 .2 mil, so. Probably just like pocket change to play, really. It doesn't matter if he gives a loan or not, you know? He'll never see the money in it ever again. Most likely. No. no. <laughs> Nana had to correct me yesterday in regards to Poe. I thought it was one of her many children that she has. It's not. Poe's one of Nana's exes. And I completely forgot who he was. Did it dawn on you after she said it? Uh, kinda. I vaguely remember it now that she said it, but... Like, she has like seven children. And... Honestly, Fredo and uh, Valdez are the only two of her exes that I actually remember the names of. <laughs> Fredo was like 18 when they first broke up. And Valdez, because he actually like wanted to hunt people down when he thought she was missing. Oh. Was that even after they broke up? Hmm? Even after they broke up and uh, she went missing? Oh. No, she... She went missing just not long after they started dating. Um, it was part of his... 